Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, welcome. So what I've been just wanting to do is just kind of this lip swatch video and review on these lovely liquid lipsticks. I just happen to be, you know, kind of cruising by Dollar General. So the first thing I do whenever I do get into Dollar General, I go straight to the makeup like it never fails, but carry LA Colors, CoverGirl, and Wet n Wild. And there was another brand there that I've seen. Um, I'm not quite sure what it was called. It was something beauty, but you know, I just had a weird obsession with just liquid lipstick. There is a lot of great brands out there, but I'm pretty much on a budget most of the time whenever I'm out shopping and all that stuff. So I did wanted to try these. They were only $2. It did say $2 even, but whenever I went and paid for them, they were $1.75. So I got more than a few. <laughs> And I did get this, get these at Dollar General. So I did went ahead and got six shades of their lovely uh, liquid matte lipsticks. They were extremely, extremely inexpensive. So I'm like, well, why the heck not? I believe they had about 12 shades, maybe 16. No, I think they had maybe 16 shades. So these are the colors that stood out the most to me. So I just went ahead and grabbed them and got the heck out of there. Yeah, like I said, they were only $1.75 plus tax. So I believe I spent like eight something. No, I went back and got a few more. So um, I probably spent, you know, whatever, $1.75 times six is. I don't know, but whatever it is, that's how much it was. So oh, let me just not make a mess here and get my life together here. It's going, so let's, let's get started. So I will just wash them on my lips. So what I'm going to be using first is the LA Colors Matte Liquid Lip Color. I really need to get my nails done so bad. I know they look horrendous right now. I'm really hoping you can see that. If not, then, then I will list everything down below in order of what shades that I did use. I'm actually going to smell it. Ugh. It smells so freaking good. Like it smells like frosting, like like cake frosting. I dig it. Okay, so we're just gonna try this one on first. And I'm just gonna quickly throw this out there. I do overline my lips, so I'm just gonna see how the how it layers on and how it dries and all of that good stuff. So, um, for the sake of the video, I will not overline my lips because I generally do overline my lips for various personal reasons. Um, but yeah, I will be overlining them with this. So, with this color, I can already tell that it is slightly sheer. Okay, so this is actually, I did two layers. Uh, it does dry pretty quickly, but you do wanna quickly put it on, and it is slightly sheer, like I said. You will need to apply more than one coat. I'm hoping just two to three will be okay. Right now, it doesn't look like it's that ugly, like layering. A consistency you know when you keep adding liquid lipstick it's like kind of like a you know that weird consistency and I'm really actually liking it on um, I'm really liking how it's drying right now so this is like a really pretty color and I dig it a lot so it seems like it dried quite a bit and dried really well so it does look pretty on and I do love it a lot and this one is suede gonna do one more layer and see how it works so this will be the third layer okay so that is the third layer and we're just gonna wait for it to dry I really like this color <laughs> I do I honestly love it a lot it's really pretty it's just like a weird cool tone nude color it's really pretty I actually like it a lot and this is how it looks with three layers on. So it is slightly sheer at first. I'm sure it's just because of the formula, but I do recommend putting at least another layer on, maybe two or three. And this is three layers, and I actually like it a lot. So I'm gonna give this one a thumbs up. So 
This one again is a wave. Let's move on to the next shade. Okay, so what color we're going to be doing next is this is Eclipse. These seriously smell so good to be honest, they really do. It pretty much it pretty much is the same consistency as the other one. I did find myself having to reapply it. It is just slightly darker than the first one that we tried on. Like I said, this one is called Eclipse and I will be putting on another layer. This is about two layers and it actually doesn't look too bad. I mean, I could use a little bit more right here on the top and then right there. Yeah, other than that, I really do like it a lot and it does dry pretty quickly. I'm just gonna add another layer just in the area where I think I need it, so. I am going just a little bit crazy with this because I do find myself reapplying and overlining my lips. It's just a habit. I do overline my lips for a reason and I am going to address that because I overline my lips for one reason, because my lips are uneven. Like, and it drives me crazy and I'm very OCD. I'm such a perfectionist, so my shit has to look flawless. So the fact that yeah, I do overline my lips. I do it for me. I don't do it for anybody else. I beat this face my damn self to make myself feel better. I just wanted to address that because I am getting annoyed of people leaving me comments and saying, Girl, you overline your lips like... Yeah, I know I do. I'm well aware because I am the one that's putting this shit on my lips. Okay? I do it for my damn self. But anyway, obviously like I'm adding layers on top of each other. You know, it's it doesn't feel bad at all. It doesn't feel thick. It doesn't feel like... Uh, like a thick consistency like on top of each other like you know that thick feeling on your lips it does not feel like that at all I really am liking these a lot they are growing on me so much and I am giving you like my uh, my honest review on these I am actually really liking them a lot I am honestly I can't wait to get to the other shades because I can only imagine how they're gonna be like I love it it feels very lightweight you do have to layer it just a little bit depending on your liking and how you like it. So what color I'm going to be using next is Vixen. Alrighty, this is actually two layers. I just let it dry and we're going to try mm, maybe one more layer just to see how it looks. Because it does look kind of streaky in a couple places. The formula actually seems a lot different with this shade compared to the last two I just tried on so it does feel a little bit different on the lips okay so this is Vixen dried and this is three layers I actually like it a lot it's really pretty okay so let's just move on to the next shade alrighty so we are going to move on to the next shade and this one is in the color fierce fias we all have the same scent but that's okay because this scent is freaking delicious. Okay, so let's just put this one on. I really love this color. It's so pretty. So this is pretty much just one layer. I do need to go back and fix a couple of areas. I really didn't want to overline my lips, but God, it is such a freaking habit nowadays. Like, But anyway, okay, so let's just go ahead and apply on another coat. I tried so hard not to overline my lips with this one. It is so hard. Alright, I'm just going to let this one dry a little bit. I really love this color though. It's like really pretty. I'm just going to go over a couple of spots again. This color is like so beautiful. I just can't get over it. I think it's mostly because it's been a while since I wore a gorgeous shade like this, but I actually really love this a lot. Like, a lot, a lot. Like, I'm becoming more and more obsessed every time I look at it. <laughs> like, it's so gorgeous. So, I am going to have to give this one a thumbs up. Well, I pretty much gave all of them a thumbs up. They're all really gorgeous on and stuff, so I'm obsessed with it. So, love this one. Love, love, love this one. Okay, let's just go ahead and move on to the next shade. Okay, so we are down to the last two. And I'm going to be doing the lighter shade. And this one is called Illusion. This one's Illusion. My nose is like getting really stuff. Like my allergies are kind of going crazy right now. Ooh. Ooh. I really 
like, ooh, I've seen this one a lot. So that was pretty much two layers, and I'm gonna add more. Okay, so I'm just gonna let it dry. This is two layers. I'm obviously gonna go back in this area right here, and I think that's about it, but this shade is actually really, really gorgeous. <sighs> My eyes are turning red, and I don't know why dry pretty quickly I mean I do like the formula a lot it is just slightly different from the lighter shades but it's obviously because it's you know a darker tone lip color so I'm just gonna add the third layer on into the areas where I think I need it so I'll just look right here now we're just gonna let it dry already so it is pretty much dry Go ahead and move on to the next shade, and this one is in the shade Danger. This one is more of a plum, like a legit purple hue in it. And then the one we just tried on before, it had more of a red hue in it, so it was more of a deeper burgundy. And this one is more of a plum. I'm just going to be doing one more layer of this shade, and then go from there. God, I am really, 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 really digging all these shades. I think they're just so beautiful. They honestly are. I am really loving these shades a lot. And so far, I don't have anything really bad to say about them. I feel like they are really great quality for what you are paying for. Well, if you don't mind having uh, to reapply, then are fine on their own, but I do recommend that you do put on a lip liner that's pretty close so you don't have to keep reapplying. I did have to use three layers on top of it, so yeah, this is danger. You know, like I said, it's just, you know, it's just basically all about personal preference, so since I'm going to try this again, I'm going to overline not overlined, but sorry, reapply. So this is technically like three and a half layers. I mean, I did only reapply an extra layer just in the areas where I thought I would need them. But yeah, we're just gonna let it dry for a quick second. So yeah, it pretty much looks dried right now. And this is Danger. This lovely lip here. And I actually really do love these a lot. I mean, I think they're beautiful and great for what you are paying for. I'm not going to say that they're the best, but, you know, they are up there. This layer, it's just slightly sheer, but it does seem like it's buildable. And once you do build up the layers, I did about two to three layers for each color. So I do recommend wearing a lip liner with these. Enjoy all of these colors. I do want to go ahead and get the rest. I am pretty sad that there wasn't more of like a bright pink, like anything from this range here, like, you know, this Jordana Sweet Creams. I wish that there was a color, a pink color that was, you know, more pinky or like a Barbie pink or something like that. Yeah, like I said, they have a range, I believe, anywhere from 12 to 16 shades. It looked like 16, um, 12 to 16. I didn't really count all of them, but these are the ones that caught my eye, so these are the ones, you know that I wanted to try. Um, this is my honest opinion about them. I really do like them a lot. They are really great for what you're paying for, so that is awesome. Dollar General. And I believe you can get them anywhere they would sell LA Colors, so like at any dollar store, because I know the Dollar Tree, and I know that obviously Dollar General does sell LA Colors cosmetics, and I really do like the liquid lipsticks, so. Yeah, everything, um, I will find, I will put all the shades and everything down in the bottom bar so you can go ahead and check that out. If you have any other questions about anything else, then just go ahead and let me know. But other than that, I, this shade is actually really gorgeous. It's such a deep plum color, like it's so beautiful. But yeah, this is Danger. But yeah, I am going to give all of these a thumbs up. I really love them. They are so beautiful. Like, I do recommend you trying these. And they were only a buck seventy-five when I got them. So go ahead and jump on it. I mean, they are pretty cheap and they are great quality for what you're paying for. So yeah, go ahead and check them out. 
But anyway, uh, I really don't have anything else to say. I really... Jazzy. But yeah, I really don't have anything else to say. I really do hope you enjoyed the video. If you have any other questions, and they're both in here. But yeah, like I said, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you have any questions or anything like that, just go ahead and let me know. Hope you enjoyed the video. Stay lovely, guys.